Alright, today it's going to be on PNG to JPEG, how to convert it. The reason for converting is, um, you know when you're taking a, a fucking screenshot in GNOME, you see some shit like this, but you only have the option of saving it PNG. They don't let you save in other format. What a big fucking mistake, you fucking idiots. Because, um, you know when you're taking a screenshot, you want to be able to send it quickly, upload it somewhere like Image Shack Flaker or some some bullshit. So you know, so you can show someone something really quick. That's the whole point of the fucking screenshot. And you know, when so, uh, if the screenshot is too big, like uh, one or two megabytes, that takes too forever, or it doesn't even go at all if it passed the on um, the limit, whatever you're using. So with that being said, um, we're gonna convert it to JPEG, which is a smaller format. And uh, I have my screenshot here, right? And we're going to be using the terminal, and the, the format will be something like this convert a PNG to JPEG. So, with that in mind, just remember that. And the first thing you want to do is um, type in convert, right? And the easiest way to do next is just drag the file that you want to convert, which is this PNG here, right? Drag it in here, and you'll see they laid out the path for you right and now all you gotta do is type in um, the name of the final um, JPEG output I'm just gonna put um, uh, image dot JPEG right and this will go to the default folder if I execute it so I execute it right and now it's gonna be um, in my uh, home folder which is here in your places okay. uh, places and home folder and um... as you can see it's out in here now see and then just open it and this was the image and now it's just JPEG uh, yes you can see it's smaller 300 KB as opposed to that other shit, I see. There's the PNG shit. I see how big it was. It was fucking idiots. Yeah, see, look at this. 1.6 megabyte. Fucking idiots, huh? So that's the quick and easy way to do it with the terminal. Otherwise, you have to open GIMP and then edit and then all this bullshit. Just use the terminal, that's the fastest way I know right now, that's all.